So the first question is asking, define the term chemistry. So, as we all know it, we know that chemistry this is the study of structure, properties and composition of matter and the changes that matter undergoes. So, that is the full definition of chemistry. As well, you can see that chemistry is the study of matter and its properties. So, that is the shorter definition of chemistry, but you can say chemistry is the study of matter and its properties, which includes solids, liquids and gases. So, in Form 1 chemistry, you know, uh, we, we studied about the three states of matter by we looked at solid, liquids and gases. And as you can see, we saw that the solid particles are closely packed together, the liquid particles are fairly packed together, and the gas particles, we saw that they are very far apart. Now, this formed the basic principle of kinetic theory of matter, if you can be able to remember. Whereby, in kinetic theory of matter, we saw that matter is made up of tiny particles that are in constant random motion. So if you could remember, we also studied that in the kinetic theory of matter. Therefore, basically, it means that in chemistry, we basically measure our facts on the different states of matter, uh, looking at them in different angles. So remember, the full definition of chemistry, therefore, is that chemistry is a study of structure, properties, and composition of matter and the changes that matter undergoes. As well, the shorter definition of chemistry will say that chemistry is the study of matter and its properties, which include solids, liquids, and gases. So that is the first question. Thank you.